Hey Aries, welcome to Earthfell. I'm Kat and I'm going to do your general reading. Okay, this is just an energy check-in. It's timeless, so and it is general, so whatever comes up will come out. Okay, remember to take what resonates and leave the rest. If it's not your story, don't try to make it. Okay, but I do get channeled messages, so um, I'm going to try to do something a little different. So instead of doing a spread, I mainly get channeled messages, and so... Um, I'm just going to shuffle the cards as I'm doing um, now, and I'm going to give you the channeled messages that I have received because my videos are running long, and so I think this will shorten up the video and also give y'all clarification and the guidance that y'all need at this time. And remember, it's timeless, so whenever you're viewing this um, message is more than likely whenever you are meant to receive the messages, okay? So, um, and remember Thomas Lou said, so this is something that you could be going through now, you've already been through, or this is predictive upon free will. All right, Aries. So, what I got for us, because I'm an Aries as well, I'm an Aries sun and moon. So, what I got for us is you will have a victory. You will have your victory. So, whatever that means to you, you will have your victory. Um... Holy Spirit, Archangels, Angel Guides, Ancestors of the Highest Light, Light, Ascended Masters. What do we have for Aries? What do we have for Aries? All right, at the bottom of the deck, it could be um, something that you're very passionate about. Um, it's a new beginning in passion, okay? This can be romance or a project or work or what have you, but um, something that you've been working on. But it brings you a great deal of passion, and it is a new beginning, okay? So that can be it as far as you will have a victory. A victory in some kind of, um, yeah, there you are, Aries. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, the Queen of Wands. Being very creative at this time. can also be a little mysterious here. But um, really going after what it is that you want, yeah. You could be single, okay, just very independent, focusing on your finances, Finances are looking good, okay, or this is this victory is going to bring you stability and finances um, As well Being very stable or you are at this time, but there is a victory coming in for you Okay, I also got others want to be like you. Okay, so You know the Queen of Wands male or female doesn't matter. They're very alluring. They have um, that energy that just attracts you Um. You know, and they're, they're go-getters, okay? They're hustlers, and um, they're very active, you know, energetic, and they, you know, they're leaders. They go after what it is that they want. And, you know, you did have the Nine of Pentacles, so being very stable and abundant as well. Um, you could also be someone that's very connected to nature, you know, things like that. But it's, you know, a channeled message here is people want to be like you, Okay. So, and it could be just that, the energy that you have or the energy that you project to the world is what I'm getting. Okay, and I um, also got others are watching you succeed. Okay, so you could be doing something online, okay, something public, or just the people around you are seeing you go for a goal, go for a project, go for something that you really desire. Okay, and you can take that however it resonates, but they're, um, they're watching you, and they're watching you succeed, so there is success here, and um, yeah, Aries, they're watching you succeed at this time. Others are watching you, and I also got that you are a natural, so whatever it is that you're doing, um, you are a natural at it. You are a natural. You are meant to do this. Okay, this is your calling. You are meant to do this. Yeah, you, yeah, people are watching. And the Prince of Swords. So you could be, you know, gathering some knowledge, information. Someone definitely could be watching you, okay, because they feel that you are a natural. All right, or they're just, again, watching you succeed, okay? It could be someone very loving, very caring, and um, someone very intuitive, very psychic, okay, in tune with your emotions. And your intuition. Also, I got your children and your grandchildren 
are protected. So if you have been having worries about your, your children, your grandchildren, anything like that, just know that the divine is saying that your children, your grandchildren, your loved ones are being protected at this time. Okay? And yeah, okay. So your life's purpose is way more than you think. Okay? So that's what I got. So your life purpose is way more than what, what you think. Okay? So whatever you think your life purpose is, yes, I believe you're on the right track, but it's way more than, than you expected. Okay, so I feel like the universe is going to gift you with, um, you know, another talent or um, another skill, something like that I'm hearing. But it's way more than, or your purpose is guiding you to something way more than you ever thought. Okay, this is way more than you ever, you ever imagined. Yeah. And it could bring some heartache, okay? Because not every one is going to be proud of you, Aries. I mean, let's live in the real world. Um, some people are going to be jealous of you. Some people are not going to be able to go with you on your journey. So there could be um, some sort of, of heartache here, okay? But your purpose is way more than you think. All right, Aries? So remember that, yeah. You could be dealing with... Um, a water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is the King of Cups, someone that has a lot of love, you know, for you. Maybe they have a hard time expressing it, or this could be you, Aries. But they want to um, bring justice to a situation, so that means, you know, something here could have been unjust, okay? Could have been not fair, and they're wanting to take a leap of faith with you, yeah. And, and bring in this love offer, and it could come in rather quickly, okay? You could be getting a lot of messages, a lot of this is passionate, and I'm getting emotional too because of the, the blue um, behind this card, yeah, most definitely. The new beginning, when it comes to um, something that brings you, you know, love, a new beginning in love, a new beginning in emotions, something that, you know, satisfies you emotionally. Yes. So definitely justice is here. Okay, you can be dealing with a Libra. Or you could have it in a chart or someone you're dealing with has it in a chart. But there's some fast movement here in regards to a love offer. Okay? About starting over, taking that leap of faith. This is your major arcana. Aries, so um, yeah, and making things right, making things right here, making things um, fair, okay, karma is on your side, Aries, yeah, because I feel like at some point you were feeling a little left out in the, in the cold, abandoned, um, you know, feeling like a lack, a lack of love, lack of um, finances, a lack of just a lack mentality, okay, not having enough, okay, or not being enough, all right, especially when it comes to um, a lover situation, it could, or pertaining to a Gemini, because this major arcana for Gemini, yeah, there was some disappointments here, there's definitely some disappointments here, because there was something toxic, okay, but the universe is coming in, and they are gifting you something, like I said, I feel like you guys are going to be gifted with something, really amazing, like whatever you think your purpose is, I think it's going to be way more than that, yeah, because there's good news coming in, definitely good news coming in about a new, oh my gosh, something that you have really worked on, okay, you've put a lot of hard work in, the universe is about to gift you something, and I feel, look, I'm getting cold chills, so I'm on the right page, I feel like it's something um, really major, and I feel like this is coming from, from the universe, from God, and you're going to receive a message about it. And it has something to do with the hard work that you've put in to a goal or a situation. Just hard work. Okay, something that you're passionate about. Because we had the Ace of Wands. All right. And the last message I got from for you is you can do this. So if you've had any self-doubt, okay, or been in that mentality of, I can't do this, okay, can't, never could, right, um, you got, you can do this, so the universe is telling you, you can do this, okay, so stop, stop doubting yourself, 
you know, you are getting a new gift here. It could be a spiritual gift. It could be, I'm getting more, you know, the Ace of Pentacles is more like a physical gift, okay? A promotion, something that is tangible in the 3D, okay? But you're going to, look, you're going to get it. Y'all just see me shuffle. There's a new beginning, and this is going to bring you stability. This is going to bring you um, abundance. It is. Yeah. It may require you, Aries, to... Use your mind, right, instead of your emotions, instead of your heart, a head over heart decision here. And it could, you know, require you to, to walk away or disconnect. Because, like I said, I don't feel like everybody's going to go with you on your journey. Yeah, and I do feel like it could be a spiritual one here. But you could be dealing with a Virgo. Yeah, that you have a firm foundation with. All right. I feel like you're going to walk away from someone that, that could be rather... I, don't know, I feel like someone's going to speak the truth. All right. They're going to speak the truth. They're going to come at you. This could be actually a lawyer or a judge or something like that that's coming to you to speak some kind of truth. Um, about this opportunity here. But it's definitely going to increase your finances. Yeah, definitely an equal give and take here. The Six of Pentacles, giving and receiving. This can be in a connection or a job. But things being made fair. You are definitely going to speak your truth. And stand up for what it is that you believe in. You're very intelligent and very, like using your intuition. You're very, very smart. Um, you've been through a lot, so therefore it's basically like your human lie detector here. Yeah, you're gaining some kind of truth, a new beginning in truth. You're having a victory here, Aries. Again, this is your sign. There you are. Aries, right in the middle of the Ace of Swords and the Six of Swords. So it's like, you know, you've gained the truth about something. You've seen clarity. Okay, and this is also victory, clarity, <clears throat> the truth. Okay, and now is you're you're ready to move on past any chaos or conflict that you've been having. You're ready to to move to calmer waters here, but you're feeling this. You can do this. What is this for Aries? You can do this, Aries. You can do this. What does this mean for Aries? You can do this. I feel like it's staying um, on track with your life's purpose getting a message here or sending a message to someone mm -hmm. defending your position defending what is yours your wish your wish fulfillment here you're going to be defending it you're defending your wish fulfillment or you're getting a message that someone is you know defending their wish fulfillment And you may, you know, you possibly could be in like this, you know, self-defensive mode, you know, but standing up for what you believe in and spirit is saying you're going to get a wish fulfillment here. You are. And definitely, definitely new love is coming in. New love, renewed love. Because look at all that emotion. That's a lot. Someone's definitely coming in and making a love offer to you, Aries, or vice versa. You hear the storm? I love it. Yeah, and things are definitely going to go in your favor. Okay, this is divinely guided, and it is fated. Yeah, for you to have the Ten of Pentacles. Okay, and this is definitely the universe has its hands in it because you have the judgment right here. So a big decision was made when it came to finances, when it came to your home, when it came to your family. A big decision is being made, okay? And things are definitely going to go in your favor. There's definitely fairness here, justice, victory. Um, you know, people are watching you succeed. And just remember, you're a natural, so no need to doubt yourself, okay? Think positive because Spirit is saying you can do this, yes. And there is a partnership here.
So two people that, that feel the same way about each other. Um, and this could be friends, family, you know, or a lover. And it does look like they're embracing each other. Watch your health, okay? Make sure you don't have any burnouts or anything like that. Because someone definitely um, wants you as their partner or vice versa. There's a connection here. Yes, yeah, someone views you as very beautiful, very abundant, very caring. Um, yes. Could cause a little, there could be a little conflict right now when it comes to your work, when it comes to your finances. But I feel that um, that's going to clear out and you're definitely just going to sit in your power um, stability here and you're going to go after what it is that you want. Yeah, and like I said, just remember not to um, not to overdo yourself to cause burnout, okay? Because there is a partnership here coming for you. There's a love offer coming for you that's going to be very successful. Okay, it's going to go in your favor. And you are going to have a victory. Whatever that victory is for you, you're going to have it. I mean, that that's winning. You're going to win. And, uh, you know, remember others want to be like you. So, you know, you're setting a good example. So I like that. And you're natural. And you can do this. All right, Aries, that's what I have for you, and I will see you next time.